Right, I'm going to look at a slightly different uh, problem now. In this case, the question's worded, a thousand mils of IV fluid is infusing at 125 mils per hour with a 15 drop set. You would set the IV to flow in drops per minute at, and that's the question. Now, in this case, Instead of being given a period of time, like 4 hours or 24 hours, for which the IV is going to be infusing, we've been given a flow rate. So from this flow rate, we have to try to calculate the amount of time it will take for the 1,000 mils to infuse with a 15 drop set. So let's write down what information we've got. We know the volume to infuse is 1,000 mils. Okay, and we know the flow rate is 125 mils per hour. And we know we've got a 15 drop set. So 15 drop set means 15 drops per 1 mil, per mil. So what is the drop rate? And the drop rate is in drops per minute. Okay, that's what we're trying to find. OK, so let's try to f figure out how many hours it's going to take for this um, IV fluid to infuse. Now we can draw up a ratio table in this case. And we're given, this is a ratio here. We're told it's 125 mils for every hour. So we create a ratio box. We put our 125 mils in one box, and it's one hour. Oops. Now. Okay, and we're trying to work out how long a thousand mils will take. So how many hours? Okay, so our ratio is 125 mils per hour. So this is going to be a thousand mils will be infusing at the same rate of 125 mils per hour. So if you look at this, using a ratio box, the method is to multiply the two diagonals and divide by the third value. Okay, so in this case it's going to be 1 times 1,000, and that's 1 hour times 1,000 mils, divided by 125 mils. Now we can cancel our units, so our answer is going to be in hours. So 1 times 1,000 is 1,000, divided by 125. We can use our calculator if we need to. We might be able to do that in our heads. 1,000 divided by 125 equals 8. OK, so 8 hours goes in here. Now, 1,000 mils over 8 hours is the same rate as 125 mils over 1 hour. How do we know that's true? How can we prove that? If we divide 8 into 1,000, our answer will be 125. So we'll just prove that. 1,000 divided by 8 equals 125. So we've got a constant proportional ratio happening here. It's 125 mils per hour. So 1,000 mils per 8 hours is the same. So we know now that our time for this problem is 8 hours. OK, now we can complete the problem like we normally do. We take our total volume, multiply it by the giving set, so 15 drops per 1 mil, and this is over our time in minutes, so 8 hours times 60 minutes, um, and it's 60 minutes per 1 hour, isn't it? OK, so we can cancel our hours, cancel our mils, and our answer will be in drops per minute. OK, 1,000 times 15 is 15,000, and 6 eighths are 48, 480 minutes. So we've got 15,000 drops in 480 minutes. Work out what that is, cancel a couple of zeros to make it easier.
Okay, 31.25. So we're going to not leave it at 0.25 because you don't get a quarter of a drop. So because it's less than 5, we drop the 2.5 off and it's just 31 drops per minute. 